come from? You look real enough. You must be from the outside. Oh, thank goodness someone finally came. I'm afraid I have some bad news for you. You're stuck here like I am. What the fuck? So Nancy, now you're finally awake. Yes, so now what? So now we got to go to the Shivering Eyes and see the great wizard like Octillion said. Man, I totally forgot. <laughs> yes, sleep will do that to you. You know, I had a dream that I was in the most beautiful place, shopping for really beautiful clothes. Dream on, where? Nobody cares about your beautiful and expensive clothes obsessions. Girls, girls, girls. Okay, Nancy, go. We need to hurry and head to the Shivering Eyes and see the Great Wizard if you, Nancy, ever hope to develop new skills if you ever hope to defeat the evil king and restore El Tamriel back to its original glory. Man, what was I forgetting? The Shivering Eyes. The Great Wizard. We need to hurry. I know the way to the portal. Follow me. Can I come along? Yes, you can, Blair. But if things heat up in battle, you just play it all. I hope there's great shopping where we're going. Who knows? I hope this wizard is a nice person. Now it's time for some random Mexican. Working for too long. I need to take a break. Please, pretty please. Plus, my feet are killing me. Fine. Plus, I wouldn't want you to collapse on me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I knew you were a good pal. Don't get all mushy on me, Blair. We could all use a one minute break, because I don't even know where we are. I think we are on the banks of the mighty Oblivion River. Yes, that's it. And it's actually called the Nibene River. We need to go south on it and cross the Great Inland Bay to the Island Portal. Oh yes. By the way, I'm getting kind of hungry. Got anything for us to eat? Just 989 grams of the purest bar and milk run run made by the finest of cookies. No thanks. Well, that leaves more for me. <laughs> Why ain't we even on the main trails? Because this way is even shorter. Just follow me. I'm ready to walk again. I can't wait to return back home after this trip. We'll return when all is good. Oh boy.
first Nancy McKeon takes down Linda Hamilton, then my own champion Jennifer Garner, then Sarah Michelle Geller, then my own personal thugs Jay and Silent Bob, as well as Tom Cruise, the thugs, Ron, Howard and Big Al, and now she finally defeats Angelina Jolie in a big fight, too. I need new people. I need a whole new crew. I want Nancy McKeon and that Vulcan friend of hers, Leonard Nimoy, to both really feel the true wrath of pure pain. I know where Nancy McKeon and her Vulcan friend, along with a new blonde-headed companion, are headed to the Shivering Isles via that one portal in order to see some great wizard. I knew I should have sent an assassin to kill that oblivion off. So what say you, Sigourney Weaver? Got any new proof for me? So you want a proof? A crew that you can be really proud of? Well, I'll show you a crew. Just go that way. I'll be right behind you. You better be right, Mrs. Weaver, or else. Now check this crew out. We got everybody here you can think of, my king. So you got any skooma I can smoke? I sure can use some of that old-fashioned stash. Not right now. Oh, come on. Do it for good, old Willie. First I've got to talk to one more of our crew. Then I'll see about it. And you. You must be the world-famous one of 1001 parts. Yeah, Berg. I'm Ron Jeremy. I'll do just about anything you ask me to do. By the way, wanna check out my most famous of my 1001 parts? It is nice, long, hard and sharp. Wanna see? No, thanks. I was actually describing my long sword. Not the other thing. I see. Well, well, well. Now we're back in true business, once again. Look out, Nancy McGill. We are coming after you. <laughs> I am so inside the Shivering Isles once again, <laughs> I am so going to find Big Head and kick him in his big head, <laughs> But first, we, I mean you, Nancy Jo, have got to go see the great wizard of the Shivering Isles. I hear that he or she or whoever this wizard is will teach you the way towards being popular. I totally forgot. How could I forget? <laughs> this place is a total dump. There is nothing here. No sex Fifth Avenue. No Nina and Marcus. No Macy's. No Dookie's. No... Can it there, or I'll give you a knuckle sandwich. Oh, yeah? Knock it off, you two. We got to now head up into the high ridge line and head east. None of you girls are afraid of walking on high, narrow ridges, are you? Me afraid? No way. Nothing scares me. You lead the way. Nancy, go. I hope there's a Macy's or Dookie's on the way, because I need to shop and buy a bunch of extremely expensive clothes. This walk is getting to be too long for my precious feet to bear. This is a walk only a tough muscle man would do. You wanted to come along there, so now you have to walk the great distances like me and Spock. Oh, great. Well, my precious toes are killing me. So how long till we stop again? When we get to the next town, then you can rest your precious little feet. No, no, girls. No need to shout like a couple of house cats. According to my data bank, there should be a quaint little town just on top of this long steep gate. See there, Spock here knows everything. He's super duper intelligent. He's a freaking Vulcan after all. Thank you, Joel. Looks like 
we'll stop here at this very town and eat and drink a bunch of random pink potions. You know where? All the wine and you did the last few days we were traveling? I had to carry all your expensive luggage all by myself. And you wear? Trust your dumb prettiness is all you carry. Here. This place suit you any? Where? Girl, this place scares me. There's a giant bug on the picnic table. What do you expect? Where? We're in the shivering freaking aisles. This place is filled with huge bugs and all kinds of odd things. I hate bugs. I hate him, I hate him, I hate him. Looks like I'll be eating good tonight. Let me get that giant bug for you. Well, looks like someone cleaned the mess up for you. Happy? Well, smoke him if you got him. Isn't smoking bad for you, Spock? I think I'll decide that. Don't worry, it's not a good old skooma. I'll save that for later. Just good old tobacco is all that's in the pipe. Oh. Well, looks like I'm gonna go for a walk around this town. Don't get into any trouble now, Nancy. I hear the people here are just plain weird. Mike knows much. Tell some. Mike knows many things others do not. Mike prefers to adventure alone. Others just get in the way and they talk, talk, talk. Thank you. I can't believe it. I can't believe that they actually made it into the Shivering Isles. But how? Last I've heard, the portal is completely surrounded by water. Water. That Vulcan must have used some kind of magicka. Water walking, and cast it on them too so they can water walk to the portal. Damn 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 damn. I may have an idea, my king. You see, I've devised a way we can all go to the Shivering Isles. Go on. You see, I created a flying machine. Yes, a flying machine using rear glamour technology. Just look above you, my king. Excellent. Excellent, excellent. Excellent, excellent. Only problem is, is that it needs some repairs. But don't worry, my king, I have some excellent mechanics fixing the machine right now, and she'll be good as new and ready to fly. Okay. So we all will wait till then. Then we'll ambush Nancy McKeon when she least expects it. Willie Nelson, here, have this. Skuma. Oh, thank you, my king. Now go play. Yes, sir. Nancy, looks like you've been gone a while now. I've only been gone for 30 minutes. I was hoping you'd bring back some food and supplies for our long trip, you know. But instead, you bring back Indiana Jones. What's up with that? Hey, the guy just followed me back. He must be homeless or something. I can't help it, you know. What's next? Pikachu? Oh great. Now we got ourselves a land party going on. Hey, just because that yellow animal decides to get into my pocket doesn't mean he's mine. Pika pika! What's next? Indeed. Go away. Nancy, we got to get going now. We got a great wizard to see, you know. Is this wizard gonna be someone who's gay? I don't know. Is he gonna be Michael Jackson or Elton John? Or is he gonna be someone boring? I don't know. Is he gonna be Gandalf the Great? 
I don't know. Is he gonna be Elvis? I don't know. Joel, I hope this wizard is someone handsome, so he can be all mine. Where? I don't know. I don't even know who this wizard will look like. Tell me. Do you girls feel like you're suddenly in a bad sci-fi film? What do you mean, Spock? It's like someone has been following us or something all this time. But who? No, I am scared. Who would follow us all this way? One of us is in deep trouble. Yeah. I'm here to see the great wizard of the Shivering Isles. He dwells inside a hidden underground lair east of here. Come on, don't bullshit me. My mission is to protect you. Who are you? Nancy McKim, of course. The blonde is Blair and the tall one is Spock. And who are you? This is me, Arnold Schwarzenegger. I'm a cybernetic organism. I have detailed files on human anatomy. My CPU is a neural net processor, a learning computer. Hmm. Okay. This guy needs to go down. So Spock, you think we should just go and ditch this dude? Nancy, he may be onto something, you know. Just go by the bullcrap that he says. I know he don't make any sense and that he's just passing through trying to annoy people like us. I want to ask you a bunch of questions. First, I would like to just get to know you. I am Go. And my friend Blair, well, we're like best friends and all, and we like to fight a lot. Right now, there's this evil guy called the BK King that's trying to take over all of Tamriel and the Fifteen Realms. Son of a bitch! That's why I and my two friends need to go by, so I can see the Great Wizard and gain training, so I can defeat the evil BK King and restore all of Tamriel and the Fifteen Realms. Yes. 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 Come with me if you want to live. Let's go, Nancy. I'll go in front of you guys. I hope this is good. No. 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 Stop it! Wake up! Wake up! Come on! Wake up! Go, Scott, go, I know it is not moving. He appears stuck or something. Mark you, asshole. Hasta la vista, baby. Goodbye. I'll be back. Let him be, Blair. We can make it on our own. We need to keep on walking. Plus, I can feel the wizard's underground temple nearby. There's nothing to see here. This place is too ugly. And you, you are too. Oh yeah? Well, you ain't exactly Mrs. Perfect. Why did I bring this novel with me? Go, Blair, I think we should stop. Something doesn't feel logically right about that mountain top up ahead. Don't worry, Spock. There's nothing up ahead except a mountain top with a weird monument on top of it. We'll wait here if it makes you feel better. Very wise and logical, Nancy. Plus, it's getting late in the day, too. Hey, <laughs> you just got sacked ah, by a single chicken ah, egg. My balls. 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 My My balls. My My balls. 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 But how are we gonna smoke that person out? Spock? I think I had another one of my brilliant ideas. Well, what is it? I have a better idea, Nancy. 
Do you play music on this loud stereo system until they come out from hiding? Great. Now we can be and we are in a tropical country smoking out some drugged up dictator. No, to think of it, I don't think this will work. Oh, yeah. Trust me. It does work. The car of Brooks and Dwight Yoakam. So you were the ones who threw those things at us? Yes, that was me. <laughs> and, by the way, it was totally fun watching Leonard moaning in pain. And, by the way, Nancy McKim, Leonard Nimoy, none of you two are ever gonna get past that mountain behind me. And Blondie Blair, turn back now. How did that cowboy know my name? And are there supposed to even be cowboys here at all? Who knows, Blair? Only the great creator would know. I would like to take those cowboys down for egging my nuts. But Garth, I thought we were gonna go and just egg them for the fun of it. Shut up, do right. Yes sir, Sir Garth Brooks, the one and almighty. You will never get past this mountain peak, because you are not one of us. And now, Nancy McKim, you must die. Prepare to meet your doom. Die, Nancy McKim. Feel the true wrath of my thunder stain. Oh, he hit. Did you see that, Spock? Garth Brooks just transformed himself and grew to monumental heights. Yes, I saw it, Nancy McKeon. What are we gonna do now? I'm out of here, go! I'm going to hide somewhere! See the true rest of my understand. Die. I'm going to do some serious battle with this giant. I'll be right behind you, Nancy. Whoa! Ouch! That didn't go too well! I think I broke some vertebrae. I'm getting too old for this stuff. I'll catch up with you in a few moments. Dark Brooks, you're mine! Die, Nancy! Ouch! Yeah. Whoa! Ouch! Ouch! Damn, that one didn't go too well. I hope you're alright, Spock. Nancy, here's your end. Use it to launch up onto him and kick him in his high nuts. Up, up, and away. You're mine, Darth Brooks, or can I call you Darth Maul? Either way, you're mine. <laughs> you think that trick is gonna make me down? That trick is like the oldest trick in the book. Ouch, whoa, ouch. I'll show Barth Maul the way the Federation welcomes deal with bad guys. Man, this guy is so huge. Thank God I beamed myself to this very key. If I were human, I'd say Barth Maul is a giant asshole. But only if I were human. So what now, Spock? What is Plan B? At the count of three, we jump up onto the feet behind us. Ready? One, two, three, jump. I don't know if Garth Maul will see us from up here. They do think they can hide from me just by jumping up onto that one single tree. Ha, ha. I'll show them. Prepare to eat my fire. I'm coming. Get ready. Jump, Nancy. <laughs> Talk about a real cliffhanger. I don't wanna fall to my death. You still got your end, don't you, Nancy? Let's see. Oh, yes, here it is. Nancy, lock it into the cliff, and use it as a jumping ledge. Okay, here I go. Wee. So you're ready for more. Huh, Nancy McKim. You just don't learn, do you? Aye. Out. Fuck out. Fuck out. Whoa. 
out. I think I snapped a vertebrae and bruised my knee from that large hit. Nancy must be in trouble. I need to hurry from this alone with Andrew and Temple and Doom Cliff Lime. I am coming, go. Nancy McKim. I'll just turn my head today, and my new weapon of Doom should really work. <laughs> Yeah, what? What true pain? More of your lame-ass guitar hitting swings. Ha. So you think I only hit with my mighty guitar? A little dark elf. Eat this. Nancy. Leonard. You're next. What was that? Nuclear war. What is nuclear war? Something that Darth Maul has been hiding in his sleeve. It looks like we got ourselves a fallout victim here. Nancy, I don't want us two to get nuked and end up being three fallout victims in all. I will get you, Nancy McKim and Leonard Nimoy. I will get you both real good. Nancy McKim and Leonard Nimoy, welcome to the true day after. Soon, this will be a true red dawn. Prepare to eat my dawn's early lights and be turned into fallout. <laughs> Nancy McKim, for your dear life, duck and cover, or we will be three fallout victims in total. Nancy, duck and cover right now. No, Spock. I don't want us to die. I don't want to be fallout. No need to worry. Indy is here to save you. How are you gonna save us, Indiana Jones? Go inside the fridge. Both of you. He may be right, Nancy. Plus, it's got room for two. And we may survive being nuked. Okay, Spock, now what? It's cramped and all dark in here. Just hang on real tight. We're going for a ride. Talk about a heck of a real crash landing. You do realize we were inside a refrigerator while we got nuked, don't you? Yes. And Garthmall ain't gonna give up until we're dead. I'll see to it that Garthmall doesn't kill us. He must be defeated. I will turn you into ground beef. Prepare to die now, Nancy McKim. You're not gonna kill anybody, you giant brute. Hey, Nancy McKim, it's the Great Wizard. Check him out. Hey, there. It's the Great Wizard. You can now come out of hiding. The fighting is over, now. Cole, what happened? See for yourself. It's the Great Wizard. He's to train me to becoming better. <laughs>